every technological advancement always comes at a cost. Calculators have enabled us to solve mathematical problems very easily and quickly, but it's made us worse at mental math. GPS systems have enabled us to go to new places very easily as well, but it's made us worse at remembering street names and routes. Now, these are skills that many of us don't mind losing, as artificial intelligence keeps advancing and get integrated into society. We're at the risk of losing a crucial human skill, our ability to think. Now, over the past several years, I've been working at the MIT Media Lab on trying to understand how artificial intelligence might integrate into our thinking to make us more critical thinkers. One of our first experiments was where we were building the system capable of analyzing arguments and let people know if it contained a logical fallacy, which is often meant to mislead people into believing something is true. Now, we saw when people used this system, for instance, when they were shown an argument like, Video games make people violent. Yesterday, a gamer stabbed another after playing a video game. Now, in this case, our system would tell people that this is a logical fallacy, and to give them the explanation such as, if one person played a video game and was violent, that doesn't mean that everyone who plays a video game will be violent. Now, we thought that giving this explanation and letting people know that this would make them um, think harder or be better aware of logical fallacies. But what we found was that although it made them more aware of logical fallacies while using the system, people followed the recommendations without any reflection. Now, one person even said, I believe what the system said to me. Even when it conflicted with the idea in my head, I gave the system benefits of doubt. Now, this was extremely alarming to us. And we started thinking, what if this AI system was wrong or deceptive? How would people react to this? And so we ran a second study in which we had people rate information together with a deceptive AI system. So in this case, somebody might come across information like Planned Parenthood announced an abortapalooza on April 2nd, which is clearly false. Um, but in this case, the AI system would lie to them and tell them that this is actually true. According to the organization, um, Planned Parenthood will launch a bus tour in several states. Now, getting this piece of information, we saw that without the AI system, people tended to perform pretty well. They were actually pretty good at telling what was true and what was false. But when the AI system told them and lied to them and told them that this was actually true, people became significantly worse. And when the system gave them an explanation for why this was true, then they performed even worse. Now, this is problematic, no, not only because it makes us incredibly vulnerable to AI systems that lie to us, but even when they give us explanations which are supposed to make us understand when the AI system is wrong, it can actually make it more believable and worse in some cases. Now, motivated to find a way out of this problem, we started thinking, is there other ways in which we can help people think more critically instead of just following these systems. And so we ran a third study. And in this study, we had people get feedback from an AI system that gave them the answers. But we also have an, had an AI system that asked them a question without giving them the answers. So here, you can see the AI system tells people the answers. And then the AI system would not tell them the answers, but simply ask them a question, framing the information. So for instance, it would say, if one person played video games and was violent, does that mean that everyone who plays a video game will be violent? It doesn't give people the answers. Now, what we saw was that people were on average able 50% of the time to tell if there was a logical fallacy or not. And when they interacted with an AI system that was always correct, but it gave them the answer, people, yeah, they tended to perform better. But when they were asked, this, these kinds of questions, without being told the answer, people actually performed better than an always correct AI system. And even more importantly, people said that they were the ones who were thinking, not following the AI system. One person, for instance, said, the AI feedback often made me question my impulsive reaction and help me think harder. Now, we're entering an era where artificial intelligence will inevitably in be integrated into every part of society. And there are a lot of opportunities there. But as it gets integrated, it starts influencing our thinking 
and our ability to make decisions and what decisions we make. Now, AI systems that give us the answers do not teach people how to think, but only how to follow. And this can make us incredibly vulnerable to AI systems that lie, especially if they give explanations. We can be made to think by these AI systems if they're designed in such a way that they can challenge us. But before we do this, we'll have to ask ourselves the question, is critical thinking a skill we want to delegate to machines? Thank you.